poikikoos, den ties allemaal moos. Onder die oprooi vlees, zelfs een snoek is boos. Hallo, hoe is het? Mijn naam is Ben Kruger. Welkom in mijn kitchen. En dit is poikikoos. En mijn speciale gast vandaag is Adele de Wet. Adele is een actress. Ze is een black belt ninja yogi. Ze doet yoga, bending over stuff. En ze is een drinking buddy of mine. Cheers, welcome to my kitchen. Thanks for having me. It's very exciting. The papaya. <laughs> yeah. Now, because you are a pescatarian, mm -hmm. I had an option of making a fish poiki mm -hmm. or a vegetarian poiki. And I quite frankly didn't feel like either. So I thought, why don't I think out of the box and make a salad? I like out of the box. It's good. Okay, so I'm going to now show you a two ingredient salad that will blow your mind. Two ingredients. Two ingredients. Because what is my middle name? Duh. <laughs> simple. <laughs> Order. It's the, the kiss principle. Order. Keep it simple, stupid. Yes, yes. I have here a red onion and Odell has what is known as a pepino, which is a small papaya. I want you to slice that into pieces the size of my thumb, like that big, okay. and put them in the bowl. Okay. I'll do the more difficult job of slicing the onion. All right. Is there a time limit? No. Okay. We're going to talk while you slice. Uh, what are we going to no, talk about? We're going to talk about yoga. Yoga? Yeah. So how long have you been doing yoga? S is this good? I mean, it's got, I'm going to yeah, I'm 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 make it into place. This is not an exam. Okay. So it's just it's a suggestion. It's an experiment. Yeah. Well, it's not an experiment. I've made it before. Exploration. But it's an exploration. So how long have you been doing yoga? Um, I started in 2000 and I did clean my hands, I'm just saying. Um, I started 2010. Well, I decided 2010 that I'm jumping right mm -hmm. into a te yoga teacher training. And then I did a year long course in yoga for uh, in 2011. Yeah, and then I went to Bali 2014 to go train with a guy called Matthew Sweeney in a different, like, um, style of yoga called Ashtanga, and then which I taught myself out of a book for two years, which is quite difficult. And then I went in 2018 for my teacher's training in Bali, and then I there was an earthquake, so it was quite intense. That's really interesting. Why yeah. yoga? Why yoga? Yeah, you There's, just said you like things simple. Yoga has to me never been or even looked simple. Well, um, it's the simplest way to get to your breath, actually, because we tend to focus on what it should look like, like what life should look like and what life should be like, instead of just going, how can I do and be in life, but focusing on the breath, and the breath is very simple. It's breathing in and breathing out, and that's how you get through the life, that's how you get into the posture instead of through the posture. So it's basically... Uh, a method of simplifying your life so I think ultimately you want to take yoga off the mat and not just keep it on the mat so it's been a whole journey for me because I started focusing a lot on the external and on my body and what I look like and then a couple of years ago I went this is not where I started yoga I need to take it back to the basics which is the breath which is just breathing in Taking it into your stomach, breathing up, breathing into your chest, back breathing, and letting it go. And it's amazing what one simple breath can do. Well, being an actor myself and a trumpet player, which you didn't know about me, did yeah, you? No, yeah, I'm a trumpet no. player. And, that's a lot of and, and being, you, it's, it's all about the breathing. Yes. And phrasing and all that sort of thing. So I would imagine that yoga is very good training for anybody who does that kind of thing. Yeah, and what I'm noticing right now in this moment yeah. is I struggle to do this and talk to you and focus on what I want to say about the yoga and breathing. Because you know how often we stop breathing? Yeah. When we're concentrating on something else or when we get anxious, we hold the breath. Mm. And instead of going, like, allowing the breath to move the movement. Yeah, I know what you mean. I stopped breathing when you walked in the door this morning. <laughs> The dogs are finding it difficult to breathe. I almost, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I almost put this in my mouth and then I remembered I can't. No, good dog. Sorry. Okay, now I would like you to put that in, in the there. bowl. Okay. 
So just the other thing you must know, which is, this is quite a big thing for me, is touching things and getting my hands dirty. Well, you I like want, to do it for no, you. No, I need to embrace okay. it. Okay, there you go, embrace. Embrace, embrace away. Feeling the sloppy... Um, the Papa might stay in the t-shirt though. <laughs> That's still okay. It's the, it's the feeling of yeah, stuff on my hands. Yeah, I know, I know. It took me quite a while before, as I started cooking my own journey to get used to Touch. touching food and stuff and I still have a little bit of a problem with the paw paw because it's kind of a slimy. A paw problem. Yeah, it's kind of slimy. I have know? a slight paw paw problem. Now you will have noticed that I cut the onion into very tiny little pieces. Tight, very super tiny, yeah. Okay. And I'm now going to mix this salad. I want to say rosemary. I don't know. It's coming up for me. And I'm not a, I'm not a foodie person. So. Possibly rosemary. Yeah. Uh, what I have in the back of my mind is um, blue cheese. Oh, <gasps> I love a blue cheese. Have you got? Yes, I have. But there's we, only two. No, we're gonna we're gonna taste this. Okay. And then we're gonna add the blue cheese okay. and decide whether that was a good idea or not. Okay. In the meantime, it's I'm gonna, gonna, right I'm gonna find you a cloth quickly so yeah, you can. Yeah. Because I'd like to have yeah. a. Um, add it. Just, just, just be one second. I'll be back. I'll be this back. It's actually okay. getting sticky and hard. Oh my! It's actually getting a little bit um, weird. Like I wanna touch. I wanna lick it, and we can't lick it right now, which is also a bit odd. Oh, it's nice and warm. <laughs> it's cold so quickly. It's like on the plane when you get those little things. It's like warm and you're like, oh, oh that lasted like all of <laughs> two seconds. Yeah, I know. Okay, what do we do with this? You give it to me. Okay. There's your spoon, there's my spoon. Okay. Now let's take a bite and see if we should add the blue cheese. But how would we know if we should add the blue cheese or not? What if this is great? Well, then we add the blue cheese and see if it's and better. See, okay, so we're not going to see if it's if we need to add it. We're, we're, we're going to add, add, okay. add it. We're okay. going to okay. add it. But we need to get a little bit of everything, which yeah. is not difficult, because there's only two things. heard about this I said nah man can't be can't be possibly raw onion and pork pork mm. and look at it now and it's weird because now I almost had a sip of my wine and then I went I don't wanna I don't wanna mess this up oh I'm gonna touch it again no no I'll do the touching maybe I should no okay. then I'm gonna run and find cloths and stuff again you know, no, maybe right. I can just leave my fingers <coughs> Maybe you could. Oh, I love a blue cheese. Yeah, so do I, so do I, so do I. You know what's my favorite meal? Can mm -hmm. I say? Am I allowed to say? Of course. A four cheese pizza mm -hmm. with extra avocado, extra caramelized onion, and extra sun dried tomato. But the, if they have a blue cheese, a quattro formaggi, I, ugh, that's all I eat every Saturday night. Now I don't even need the blue cheese. I'm, it's really, already in there. I'm really fortunate that I. Um, I like a, a wide variety of food, so, so I'm, doing, uh, oh, no, 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 I'm doing the licking. Oh, yeah. I thought you said we can't lick. <laughs> <laughs> to have your spoon and dig in, let's I see. I always did lick it now. Let's see if this is an improvement. Well, let me just do the mix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. An improvement or a disaster. Nothing with blue cheese came with it. Even eggplant, which I hated. As soon as I put blue cheese on it, I loved it. Now I just eat eggplant. Mm. Yeah. Don't just have cheese, you have a bit of everything. Now I'm gonna I'm just delve in for it. I'm quite particular. See, even the fly wants it. <laughs> oh, 
with that I face. Mean, with that face, I don't even know who it is. Yeah. Oh, mm. it's like an explosion in my tummy. Mm. We just had the discussion about emulsion, putting stuff together that might not work, but the separately they're the unique all together. That blue cheese is the emulsion of this. Mm. I think we all do something here. So next time you come to visit, I make a lamb for you. Mm. Well, everybody else is eating that. You and I can chow down on the blue cheese, onion, and pork salad. And you know what's amazing about this? You know how they have like a cheese platter at the end or a pudding? This. This is, this is the whole thing. All in one. This is a salad and a pudding. Mm. So you're actually cutting out all that crap. Look at you, babe. Thank you so much for coming to visit me. This is amazing. And thank you for helping me discover something new. Well, you would like invited me to discover something new. So there thank you for the invitation. And thank you guys for watching. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, you can go away now. We're going to make pigs of ourselves with a salad. <laughs> Grab this spoon, Mickey. Oh, I thought it's a feeding bag. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's a little bit of everything. Mm. Oh, it's so much cheese. Oh, it's a real thing. I love it. 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 I love it